Hi, it's me again with Corel Doll Tips and Tricks, and uh, this video is probably not necessary because we duplicated this, but my mathematical genius kind of uh, guru, I guess, friend, internet friend, uh, suggested, so you've got the blend, everything's blended, it blend, we blended it 18 times. We're going to hit the plus key on the keyboard, and what that did, that made an extra copy of it right on top of it, and then you could start blending more, and I didn't really understand until we got to 37, and watch what happens. It's darker at the top like we wanted. Uh, you didn't have to go back and forth, and they are, I mean, they're clear, sharp lines because they're on top of each other, uh, or some of them are on top, some of them are in the middle. Um, I guess we could kind of prove that just by moving it out of the way. So this one is half that other one. So this one, there are some in the middle. I guess what we could do is, uh, with a blend, you can't really mirror it. But I guess we could try to mirror it this way and see what it looked like. And so that's what's happening. Uh, there's lines in between the lines plus the lines themselves. Not that big a deal, but it is kind of a neat effect. Uh, to get something, you know, you could have done it just by blending 37 times, but uh, this way, if you didn't like it, you could start over and, you know, do something else. And um, anyway, just thought I'd throw that out there. Anyway, hope that helped. Thank you for watching.